Yo, what is up, you guys? This is Sizzler TV coming at you with another great awesome unboxing slash review. As you can see in the title of the video today, we're doing an unboxing under over the Under Armour Curry 2. And let's get started. Alright. Let's open up the box. I got my shipping in today from Under Armour. Alright. Well, when you open the box, you're going to get a receipt. Okay. Thanks for shopping at UA. The shoe is $129.99 from underarmor.com. As you can see right there. And just put that aside. And let's get to the shoe. So once you open the box, there's nothing on it, as you can see. Everything's empty. And here's the shoe. So it's something nice that Under Armour does, you know, they bring up big, big old boxes. Here's the Under Armour Curry 2. <clears throat> I got mine in a size 11 and a half. My most common size, so you guys already know, for those of you that have been watching me for a while. Here's the Under Armour logo on the right hand side of the box. <coughs> Curry's number, number 30. On top of the box, the block, the box is black and yellow. And the Under Armour on the other side. And Under Armour <coughs> on the side of the box. Some of you guys can see that. There you go. And more Under Armour logos <coughs> where they're located. In case anything, anything goes wrong in the size. Or it doesn't fit. Well, let's open the shoe, you guys. Let's get to it. <clears throat> well, when you open the box, you have your I Can Do All Things number 30 paper. Oh man, the shoe is just amazing. <clears throat> um, just to let you know, you guys, every Under Armour Curry 2 has a specific name on the shoe. This one. It's the Under Armour Curry 2 Height Street. Each and every single Curry 2 and Curry 1, if you guys pay attention to the details of every single shoe, has a specific name on each Curry. This one is the Height Street, as you can see. And this shoe is, I had to get it because it's very, very detailed, specifically coming from the midsole. That's one of the things why it, what caught my attention to the shoe. And then also the laces. That's another thing that caught my attention into the shoe. Not to mention the, uh, the I can do all things also on the shoe. You guys can see that. Let me focus it on for you guys. There we go. So it's something nice that the shoe has. And there's the bottom midsole of the shoe. And you got your blue design on the bottom of the shoe. You got your Under Armour logo on the bottom of the shoe. And then you got your number 30 on the side of the shoe. And then you have the speed form tongue material on the shoe. You also have the charge kit, the cushioning on the blue midsole. It says right there on the shoe, charged. And you got your heel tab. Right here on the back of the shoe for better support on your Achilles, you know. Something very, <clears throat> very nice to know. And you got your blue laces with the SC on Curry, as you can guys can see that. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then you got speed form on the sole inside the shoe. I don't know if you guys can see that. And you have also the number 30 curry on the tongue. I don't know if it's yellow or green. Let me know in the comments below you guys what you guys think. What color it is. So let me get you guys the other shoe. <clears throat> I 
The shoe is the same on the other side, you guys. On the other side, it says the same thing. I can do all things. Little midsole, charge cushioning. As you can see that right there. Let me focus it for you guys. There it is. <clears throat> Same speed form tongue for the material. You got your blue and white laces, which is very, very nice. You got your number 30 curry number on the side. The thing that, that I like about the curry twos is this. This, uh, these bubbles right here. More breathable, better air on your foot when you lock it down. Also on this side right here. <clears throat> and you also have the height street. Same thing on the other side of the shoe. Which is something nice to know. And I got mine in a size 11 and a half. Here's the Under Armour logo in white. And let's put a let's put the shoe and a side by side view, you guys, <clears throat> on both of them. <clears throat> now you guys can get a better better look at the shoe. <clears throat> Excuse me. So here's the Under Armour Curry Two High Street. You guys, the shoe is very, very nice. I like it. The only reason why I got the shoe is because my favorite color is blue. And I'm a big fan of a mixture of colors, so I liked it that it was blue and white. That's another thing that caught my attention into the shoe. And I got mine in a size 11 and a half. If you guys can see that right there in the bottom left-hand corner. And the shoe is marvelous. It's nice, you guys. Let me know in the comments below. What's your favorite curry too? As by far right now, since they've been releasing so many colorways. Here's the shoe, you guys. <clears throat> side by side view. There's the back of it. Here's the other side. Got your blue midsole on one side. And yeah, you guys, I mean, this shoe is awesome. I like it personally. Let me know in the comments below if you guys are going to get the uh, Under Armour Curry 2 Elite. That's going to be coming out in the next week or so. And yeah, you guys, uh, if you guys enjoyed watching this unboxing slash review over the Under Armour Curry 2 Height Street, make sure to leave some comments below. Let me, let me know if it was an all right shoe for you guys. Did you guys cop it or did you guys uh, not cop it? And yeah, you guys, this has been another great, awesome review over the Under Armour Curry 2 Height Street. I've been Sizzler TV, and hopefully you guys enjoyed. And if you guys are new, stay subscribed to my channel for more awesome unboxing slash reviews over sneakers. I should be unboxing next the Nike Kobe 11 Elite, which is the black and white colorway. Hopefully you guys know which one I'm talking about. And uh, stay tuned, you guys. So stay safe, take it easy, stay in school, and stay subscribed to my channel. And I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.